They still got the fish. I wish the fish died, even though... No, the, the fish, fish died. She swallowed him. Oh, she did swallow him. Yeah. I, the whole time I was expecting the fish Which to come didn't back. didn't turn me on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No one, no one thought that. Right. I honestly, I honestly didn't. That did not occur to me. I'll be, I'll, I'll be honest with you. I'm kind of thrown by the turned on one. Kind of, kind of took that my train of thought. I just didn't expect that. I, guess, but. I mean, um, I, I, I suppose now that I think about it, I understand it. I don't agree with it, but you know. People like different things, I suppose. I said it did it. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Juice Labs. What's up, everybody? We're here with the season finale of Umbrella Academy. I'm Clay. I'm Juice. I'm Corey. What a journey it's been, huh? Wow. <laughs> Umbrella There's been Academy. Ups. There's been downs. There's been superheroes. All Plateaus. through the timeline. Powers and such as. So how did Ben keep growing as a ghost? No idea. I, I brought that up in the beginning. I was like, didn't he die as a child? But he's like the same age as them. So, I mean, that means they changed something. And Diego's girlfriend's gonna come in very handy because her power's only good against superheroes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's that's why she's a good zero on the on the one two three four five six seven. Yeah. She's yeah. kind of like a. Uh, she has no powers until there's other powers involved. And then yeah. she has the best powers. <laughs> yeah. So they didn't show his alien head. They, yeah. They never address the fact that he's an alien. Or parallel universe. But and then it's a young because that was a young Ben. Not bad. He looked the same. He just had a different he looked, hairstyle. He looked like teenage Ben, in my opinion. No, it's still 2019. So I don't but think he had a age. He but they the had age. a but they had a painting of him that looked like our Ben. Uh, he's just, he's the same age, I think. He's just a, he's rocking a different hairstyle. Now, the handler's dead. Thank Christ. And Herb, who just got introduced two episodes ago, is now the chairman. Which I like him. Yep. We didn't see a pogo. There could easily have been a, a parallel dimension I mean, it, pogo. It, there certainly could oh, be. Oh, they didn't show pogo. Ideally, he would still be a monkey. I would assume maybe just like a different maybe hairstyle he's an orangutan. as well. <laughs> yeah, instead of chimpanzee, he's a orangutan. Yeah, I don't know. That'd be fun. That seems like a big change. And they're all gonna meet themselves. We're getting closer to dark every single fucking time. Yeah. <laughs> I think everyone's gonna be the same with different hair. Yeah, they all have bangs. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. It's just like dark. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, bedhead bags. <laughs> yeah, everyone in a parallel dimension is them, but with bangs. <laughs> yeah. To signify that they are in an alternate dimension. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, I, I wonder... Now, this upcoming season, we might need the red X's we've been talking <laughs> <Yeah>. about. <laughs> put a red X on your head right now. Yeah, right, that's what I would do right away if I saw those people. Before we even fight, I'm looking for a marker or something. Because at some point, I'm going to be wrestling with myself. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And you're going to have a gun. Sure. And mm -hmm. I'm going to be saying, shoot him. And he's going to be saying, shoot him. <laughs> and this always happens. I was mm -hmm. thinking about just existing as number five when he's in this, like, sort of, like, he exists in this space where he can jump back in time to yeah, find himself, maybe. And, like, wouldn't you always just be on alert? walking through your everyday life for yourself coming to kill you to take your place in the timeline because like you would yeah it's I think scary. he does he's always on edge he's always got to be on edge for himself and then if you see yourself coming to kill you you know that you're just totally fucked because he's if you kill him he's only coming to kill you because you eventually die or do something horribly wrong mm -hmm. and then if he kills you well you still die uh, I mean how does he, but it, then again he doesn't have a job that's true Oh no, he works for the commission. What a stressful time for <laughs> all this has happened. This is a lot of stress in under three weeks. Yeah, these people got to decompress. Yeah, I mean it was years for other people, but yeah, That's for what number I mean. five, for, for five, it was three weeks. Yeah, man. Well, I wonder what. He, yeah, he's out of the commission now. Uh, I don't know. Is he? Well, yeah, I, I don't mean, think he's working for them. Yeah. but it seems like the commission is. I mean, 
that was everybody, right? And Vanya just killed everybody. Would just, would it be a good time to apply? That's what I'm saying. You yeah. have to ask Herbie and be like, what the fuck's going on? Yeah, it's like getting in the union. They, yeah. yeah. Now, there's probably a lot of openings over at the, at the Yeah, convention. well, they're probably hiring like crazy. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway, they you know, lost so from their end, it's a lot of, like, uh, pensions they're not going to have to pay out. And for yeah, that's stuff. true. Well, the life insurance company must be... Oh, yeah. Oh, God. They, they're going to go bankrupt. Yeah. They're not ready for this. They're just probably... Whew. Well, you know, insurance is never pay out. Yeah, it's, it's tough to get them to pay I mean, out. But they were killed. That's going to be tough. They were killed on the job doing their job. I mean, that's pretty standard. Yeah, that's... Yeah, you know what? They actually might be financially in a huge hole. Yeah, I mean, well, it depends if, like, but if yeah, the if company you... has any liability as far as the life insurance goes, yeah, I would or if so. it's... Right? But are all these people just living by themselves solo? Because, like, who's the beneficiary if you die if you have life insurance? Like, right? five... Gail... Who's he giving money to? Yeah, Gail and, um... Can't think of the other one's name, but the two of them didn't have anybody to Hazel. Yeah, Hazel. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, but they weren't killed actively on a job. No, but I'm saying even them as an example, they don't have any beneficiaries. I bet Pete. You know what they're like, probably all my happy shit's about? going to my sister. Hopefully, she doesn't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I get. But Corey gets money if I die. Or yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can't remember who I put as my beneficiary. Actually, I, I think I turned down the life insurance. <laughs> I work bad. in an office. Yeah. <laughs> it's bad. Yeah, well, I, th I think mine was, was. I think mine wasn't an option, actually. You know what? They're probably fist bumping over the fact that they wiped out probably whole families when Vanya did that. Like, oh, if I die, it all goes to my wife, who's also, also an agent. Well, they're both dead. No payout. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah. I, I'm sure they're up to their necks in paperwork. <laughs> yeah, either way. Yeah, no, it's gonna whatever it is decided. There's no way they're not up to their necks in paperwork. Yeah, they have to pick a whole new board. They still got the fish. I wish the fish died, even though... No, the, the fish, fish died. She swallowed him. Oh, she did swallow him. Yeah. I, the whole time I was expecting the fish Which to come back. Which didn't turn me on. <laughs> <laughs> okay. No one, no one thought that. Right. I honestly, I honestly didn't. That did not occur to me. <laughs> I'll be, I'll be honest with you, I'm kind of thrown by the turned on one. I kind, of, kind of took that my train of thought. I just didn't expect that, I guess. But. I mean, um, I, I, I suppose now that I think about it, I understand it. I don't agree with it, but, you know, people like different things, I suppose. I said it did it. <laughs> You're right. You're right. You're right. <laughs> the fuck, yeah. Come on, <laughs> um, Harlan's a super villain. At some point, you know what they're probably gonna face. Actually, it makes perfect sense if this show keeps going forward. Like in a, isn't it a comic? Yeah, it's a comic. Yeah. So like, it makes perfect sense to give a kid superpowers in the '60s and then jump forward. Obviously, he's gonna be like this 40, 50 year old dude when we meet yeah. him and like really powerful. And maybe Harlan's the father of all the fucking forty-two kids. Somehow, like Kangas <laughs> Cobb. That'd and that's wild. how all, everybody gets their powers. That could happen. I don't want to look any deeper than just that right there. <laughs> because it's going to get their, this their, that I just don't their care about. Yeah, timeline, their whole timeline and time travel rules don't, you know, they're not trying super. It's more one of those, we're having fun here, don't dig too deep. It's a fun <laughs> show. Yeah. Yeah. We don't need to make everything perfectly lined up like dark. We're having fun here. I don't think they did either. <laughs> <laughs> It's a f it's a fun show. Yeah. yeah. We'll see y'all for. I season had fun. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see y'all for season three in twenty twenty two probably. 